Ferrara. I'm from France, Paris, France, uh, where I was born and where I grew up and also where I started porn. When I started in Europe 16 years ago, a long time ago, I, I didn't think I would make it my job. I was uh, in college to become a PE teacher and I had three years left and I had the oppor opportunity to do a few amateur shoots. So I was making a little bit of money and I was having sex with different girls a, a lot. Right when I graduated, I, I met Rocco Freddy and uh, he uh, definitely made me change my mind. And met Stagliano that brought me 11 years ago here to LA and now I'm where I'm at because of those guys. And, and it's still as fun as it was when I started, so it's good. I think, I think you, you're born with it. Everyone can fuck at home, not everyone can do this, but also you know, obviously the, the girls in the industry and being able to change every day. It's really good for your libido to have a different girl every day and, and keep you excited about it. And I never thought of that. When I started, I just wanted to have sex, man. I, I, I never, like really never thought about a career. I never did that thinking career and uh, it just took off by itself and, and uh, yeah you have other people telling you like hey you, you're good you know and so you you're happy that they think so but I think it's weird to think yeah I'm, I'm really good at this you know uh, I wouldn't be here after 16 years I think if I was bad at it but you know just go with the flow Nowadays, very different than when I started, you know, nowadays there's zero pressure, I show up, I know I'm gonna have sex with a girl or two, three, four, you know. Um, the people I work for now are the people I'm friend with, you know, I handpick the shoots I, I do, so it's much easier than it used to. Now I, I handpick the people I work with, the people I work for, and people hire me to fuck the way I fuck and not the way they think I should fuck. Because then, now I'm long enough so people know the way I do and they seem to like it, so. I try not to perform as much as I used to. When I first came to America, I, I used to work twice a day, almost every day. I think a month, one month I did 57 scenes in one month. It was it was crazy, but it was also very easy. It was the high peak of the gonzo. It was like in and out in 45 minutes, you know. It was very easy. Uh, now, I, I try not to work as much, but it's difficult because I'm good friends with few people and they all shoot and they all ask me to work with them and I'm very weak and I always say yes, so. They know how to talk to me. They know how to get me there. I'm a pleaser, definitely. I really wanted to make series that, that show people different things. Obviously, Evil Anal, the focus is on the anal sex. I like, I like anal sex, but I like anal sex with women that like anal sex. And slutty and sluttier, that just allows me to book girls that don't necessarily do anal, but love sex. Uh, then my series Raw, it's, it's more like my personal, private collection. It's my, my, my little thing. I really wanted to go towards the more realistic and more intimate porn. And uh, the sex tape format was perfect for that. And that's why I started Raw. Uh, it can be more intimate as a porno than just a girl, a camera and me. No one else around. The girl appears the way they want to appear. I don't need them to wear fishnets and big eyelashes and uh, I want them to look as real as possible and, and show sex as real as possible too. A lot of the people at home that watch my movies or my scenes know I'm not always that fit. But, but um, 
the days I'm fit, I play basketball, I do Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. When I'm fit, that means also I'm watching what I eat. Uh, usually, I get fit be before I go on vacation to friends. So then when I'm there, I eat as much as I can. And when I'm not fit, usually it's because I just came back from friends. But uh, no secret, man. It's just, you know, I'm a regular dude, man. I, I really switch off once I'm done shooting or directing or performing. I'm completely different. I spend time with my family or my girlfriend or I do my sport. I, I, you know, I really turn it off. Like I can't be one of the people that live only for porn. Uh, I, I don't think it's healthy to do it that way. I've done, I've done a lot of gonzo all my career. I like to do different things, like maybe do a little feature here, here and there. Um, definitely not parodies. This is nothing I want to do. As a performer or as a director, I, I think. I, I, again, I'm not here. It's not about a paycheck. I don't do everything just for money. Uh, but do a little feature that I would write and and work on and do something, again, fun that I, I, I like. Um, that's something that, that can be fun, that I'm planning to actually, so uh, let's see.